So we just got our income tax check back with a decent load sum. So we figured, you know what, we're gonna go to Antler River Archery. Well, we were just we just arrived at Antler River Archery, so we're gonna go inside and basically blow a nice sum of cash on anything that we've always wanted, but you never have the money for. This is the new file the new actually. I didn't know they had it. The ancient turkey broadheads. Mm. And then how they're angled like that. Easy out, hard in. Complete opposite of a deer broadhead. <laughs> yeah, that'd be perfect. It's huge. How much is it? Two ten. Oh, that's backwards. Thank you, Income Tax. Yeah. <laughs> So I sad to go. Like an hour and a half, two hour drive back home. That's why it takes us so long to finally get out of the shop. We just got done and we were just about to leave and then the guy who works there quickly texted him saying that we forgot my bow in there. That would have been bad. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> it's always nice going to the archery shop and forgetting your bow there. by 36. This should be good enough. So we've been really wanting to improve on our archery, not just like the shooting aspect of it, but also the craft of it as well. We want to start building up our own arrows, save money and I guess grow a skill set. But along with that, when we were at Antler River, we saw this target and we couldn't leave it there since we actually had the money at the time. And now we can actually step, step back to like 60, 70, 80, maybe possibly even 100 yards and not having that like... Fear that you're gonna miss. <laughs> yeah, the fear of missing, the fear of losing your arrows or breaking your arrows. We felt like that was really like holding us back. So I think we're gonna give this a go and see what we think. It's gonna be fun. Oh yeah. So we are just gonna make sure that our 20 yards are sighted in and then we're going to try 60. Right. Or are we Slowly. 40 first? Probably 40 first. We're gonna gradually get there, but eventually. That's what we're going for.
So what we're doing with our targets, we're just putting sticky notes on them and then that's going to be where we aim so we have like a like an actual like specific spot to aim at not just like this whole general target. So it's taking me a while to sight in my bow at 20 yards because I'm just shooting off, shooting very badly lately and I don't know why. Like I used to be pretty good and then I lowered my poundage and then like you'd think it would just shoot low but nope just goes everywhere I'm not that great at it now so gotta keep practicing hopefully I can sight that in so I can actually start in my whole bow So, still shooting bad. That is at 20 yards. <sighs> Not sure what's wrong, but John's over there. How many yards is that? 40. It's 40 yards. He just put, it, he just set it in his 20 yard pin. So now he's gonna go 40, see how that goes. <laughs> it's right there, as you can tell. That right was too there. close. Honestly. I was gonna say... That was close. <laughs> I was gonna say, you might wanna like not do that because I don't know where it's gonna hit. So he's gonna try that again. I'm not gonna put the camera on the target though. Just in case. But he's gonna go back to 60 yards now and see if it drops to where it's supposed to and then he's got that sighted in. What? <laughs> he said it's really windy so it's not gonna work very good. Guess we'll see. Okay so at 60 looks like he's shooting way down there but if, we feel, if you look at it from like a pin perspective from when I was back there I'd have the pin here and it'd blow me all the way over here and like the, like because like, I'm moving like this, tiny little bit. But like I had it right up here and then the wind picked up and it was way over there. <laughs> so I was kind of just like, drag it right here, boom. Boom. Yeah. Like, we'll have to do it on a not so yeah, windy day. So I, I, we won't be able to calibrate it, but the target is definitely big enough because my shots are, as you can tell, not great. We'll figure it out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, obviously we haven't exactly sighted in our bows perfectly. Still have to work on that. It is kind of a windy day, so yeah. you know, we have to go come back here when it's a better day. And hopefully, I can get a little, lot more practice in and actually get better at shooting. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, please like and subscribe for more of our videos. All right, see you guys next time. See you guys. <laughs>